Hey guys, what's up? It's me Alex and welcome back to another updates video and this time it's gonna be on my balance and my balance is for PvP. You know, when I started doing PvP, I didn't have all of my gears, you know, but that didn't stop me from doing PvP, you know. I think I post around 9 videos already, uh, me doing balance PvP, so if you wanna check that out, uh, please uh, check on the playlist and I think uh, tomorrow I'll post another balance PvP, you know. And uh, you know, I had some struggle in getting you know some of my gears, but you know I've been farming Malister a lot, and farming Malister isn't easy because you know it's hard to find people that want to do uh, Malister. Uh, thank you, Leo and Autumn. Uh, they helped me like you know one time, and but most of the time I've been like you know uh, teaming up with random people, you know. But you know, yesterday uh, I found two guys. You know, they are so great. So I brought my a life wizard and my balance of course so you know I just team up and I found a death wizard and a storm wizard you know so basically I was jading two of my wizards you know and I was blading and healing and you know that way we did it real quick and I was you know I was telling them like you know I spent 10k crowns you know opening the chest and I didn't even get anything good well I did get something good I got the robe and the hat few times you know but I already have all of those like except for the robe I use uh, the rattle bones robe you know uh, I compared them you know and I think uh, the rattle bone is much better uh, in my opinion cause you know I got it on the first time but anyway guys so you know uh, on the first video I did for PvP on YouTube uh, I think I showed my gear and I didn't have my boots you know so uh, that was a big difference, you know. So back then, you needed more block, but you know, which I didn't have uh, much. I had like 480 something, but right now is uh, a little bit more. And also, uh, you know, I was thinking making up a new pet, but I have a jewel, so I put on the pet, so it's a little bit different now. So I'll show you my new gears and my new pet. So I'll be right back. Alrighty, guys, welcome back. So uh, basically, I'm gonna show you my gears. Uh, so start from the hat. I use the Malister hat, uh, it's because it's the best hat in the game for uh, balance, you know, especially a lot of health, uh, party chance, accuracy, uh, resistance, also the damage and shadow pip. And I think critical is okay, you know, you don't need that much. Uh, if you don't have this hat, I recommend you using the crafting hat you get from Sardonyx for level 96. Uh, it's still good, you know, uh, it gives, you know, 22% uh, person resist to all the element school. And also, you know, a little bit more damage than the Malister had, but it has no uh, power pip chance or any, uh, you know, uh, peers. Uh, for me, I think uh, Bone Smasher robe is much better than uh, Malister. I don't know, some people, you know, might disagree with me, but for me, I think this is better because, you know, if I compare it to the, you know, uh, Malister robe, is like uh, Bone Master get a little bit more health. Uh, uh, a little bit less pips, uh, you know, but I have more than enough pips that I need. A little bit less accuracy, the damage is the same, one person more uh, resistance and one person uh, more uh, critical chance and the shadow pip is the same and the card it gives a little bit different, uh, you know. Uh, mostly important thing, uh, the boots, you know, I struggled for it like a year or something getting this boot, you know, but I finally got it like I spent even 10k crowns, you know, opening the chest and my luck wasn't that great, but uh, yesterday, you know, it was my day that I finally got the boots, you know, I was really excited, you know, and now I can PvP finally, like, I still did PvP and I did pretty well, but, you know, it wasn't how I wanted to be, like, you know, so I was using this uh, boot back then, you know, a uh, little bit um, much better, I think, you know, more health, you know, one person more poppy chance, uh, one person more accuracy, one person more peers, and the block, you know, is really high, and also it gives three person more damage, which is, you know, I need a little bit more. Uh, so I use the fortune teller wand, you know, for balance, uh, I think this is the best one for balance so far. Uh, maybe if there's gonna be a better one than this then I might use it and if you guys know please comment below so you know I might try to open some packs and get it and I've been using the Duelist Fader Razor because you know uh, obviously it's the best a uh, uh, lot of blog you know and I think the other 
uh, a thing we get from uh, Morgant, I think. It gives a little bit more damage, but uh, this is, you know, what you need uh, if you want to go for block. You know, it's obviously the best. Uh, and I put some jewels on it, you know, to make uh, more better. And I've been using uh, the Rasputin amulet, of course, it's the best one. Uh, maybe some people want to use a uh, Morgant amulet, but I don't have it, so uh, for me, this is the best. And I've been trying to get like incoming jewel for my, you know, uh, overtime healing. But you know I don't have that much because I use it on my um, my myth wizard because I was doing 2v2 uh, with life wizard so you know because of that I don't have it but if I do get it I will uh, take out the like 12 uh, uh, block for fire so you know. And for the ring I'm using the duelist daredevil's ring of course it's the best and it's for level 100. Uh, maybe they're gonna upgrade it for the next world, I'm not sure, but I'm assuming they will for level 110. And once they do it, I might buy it, but this is the best so far. A uh, lot of health, uh, property chance, of course, and the most importantly is a Pierce, you know. For the pet, like, I didn't make the pet, but I think, you know, this pet would work since, like, I think I did the daily quest and I was lucky enough to get uh, the Defying Jewel and I was, you know, really excited back then. But this is good, you know, uh, with the Defender. Some people might say, like, why you still have Defender, but for me, I think Defender is pretty good. Uh, triple damage and double resist, you know. Uh, I do want to make a new pet, but I'm not sure which pet to make. Like, a bunch of new pets. Like, this one, I don't know what I was making, but, like, I made it to Mega and... I use it sometimes when I do like jading uh, if I want to fight a storm and it works pretty well. I've been thinking maybe I want to uh, level this pet to Mega and uh, make something a new pet for balance but I don't have the time and this was my old pet you know th this are not that great but it it, it still works you know if you want to do use it for questing this is my uh, for energy and this was my first pet ever but uh, I'm gonna be using this one for now and it gives a little bit more resist and alright for the deck I use the duelist devil may a care deck and this is the best deck for level 110 and obviously a 44 block and 44 crit and with the extra uh, power pip chance and also the socket you know which is the best part and also gives like two cards so you don't have to really carry a reshuffle you know but I don't think you will need it you know since you're balanced but this worked perfectly and my overall stats is pretty good I got 111 damage which is pretty good and you know other school is 38 but I don't have any uh, mastery amulet uh, nor do I need it and 56 the resistant to all school which is pretty helpful you know and uh, 26 accuracy I don't think I'll be fizzling until they put mantle on me uh, 400 critical and a 520 uh, block to all except for a fire you know and I have 34 uh, peers you know I think I might get a little bit more peers if I had any different one but I don't know if there is any if you do guys know please comment below so you know I could see it and my property chance is 94% uh, uh, it might increase a little bit if I take up you know the accuracy uh, the jewel I'm using for the deck but I think I need more accuracy so I don't want to fizzle for the healing in and healing out I think it's pretty bad but I don't heal that much but if I do need it uh, I would love to upgrade it but I don't know which gear maybe I need to change some jewel you know that would help me but other than everything is good so uh, so for my PvP I lost two match you know so far you know and I won 13 so I'm doing pretty well and I'm almost close to captain you know maybe two more matches and I'll be captain you know and I did I did some tournament as well I have five wins so far but you know I won a lot of matches with you know tie so as you can see over here like I have more than uh, six trophies I think one two three four five six actually I won six gold trophy and one of them is 1v1 and the rest of them is like you know second place and uh, two of them is for third place but it doesn't matter like I want to do some tournaments and PvP since I have the gears now so I'm really really excited guys you know hopefully you guys are hyped too so if you guys want to see more balanced PvP please hit the like button you know that would make me feel more you know comfortable like doing balance pp so since you guys want to want to see it you know that would make me feel happier and you know motivate me to do more pvp videos so 
And there's also a giveaway going on. I'll put the link in the description below. I'm currently doing the Nightmare Packs giveaway on YouTube and Twitter as well. So you can check that out. And please subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you next time.